Welcome back to Fantasy General. We're fast approaching the Blood Hearth Castle. And uh, there's two options here, Marisol Island and Tyndall Cove Island. I'll probably try this one up here, uh, Marisol Island. Let's take a quick look at the army. Uh, five units to purchase. I did buy some at the end of the last battle. Uh, I think I bought a monk and a another flyer. So hopefully we've got a good arsenal of uh, Phoenix Hawks here and we can take on the enemy flyers. Uh, now that I'm getting that kind of under control, it would be nice to invest in some of the research here as well. Uh, what do I want though? That's the question. I do want to upgrade the, the four siege cannons. Let's keep that going. 10%. Um, I do want to upgrade this, the uh, legionnaires to the samurai. So let's... I'll just do that for now. I still, still do want mostly cash. Uh, to keep buying units, but at least that will keep the uh, the research going for a little while longer. Okay, let's go to the Marisol Island. Several scouting missions to Marisol Island have turned up nothing, but the council is convinced that the Shadow Lord is planning something there. You need to perform a standard search and destroy in the island just to be certain that there is no unknown threat. So this is going to be a generic map, I think. I think they're somewhat random. Shrine, shrine, town, town. Uh, let's see, a town over there, town in the far corner. All right, hopefully I don't need to take on all of these uh, towns. The first one is fairly you know, close by here. Um, I may be able to send a second army across here as well. Um, so I think I've just got the four monks, or is it the five? And then the nine sandmen. Let's just do it that way. One more. Two more. A couple of legionaries as well. Uh, the light cav, and now we've got the flyers, so quite a few. I'll keep them fairly central. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, with a couple of harpies and the rock knights there. I think we're mostly going to be going down the center, so let's put the uh, siege engines just there. And uh, hope for the best here. There's only 15 turns, so it's a, we don't have a lot of time to, to move. Let's see if anyone's here. No one's there, so I'll send these guys. Oh, I guess we'll go through the mountains. Oh, over to that town to the east. Um, otherwise, sending this guy out uh, to scout out for the main enemy army. This could be them or one of the armies. Sometimes there's a couple. Oh, there's, there's more to the east over here. All oh, right. Okay. So, uh, let's, let's watch out for those knights as well, the really um, tough ones that killed my monks in the last battle. Can grab that now. Probably going to be coming through the woods. Send two of the siege um, cannons off in this direction as well to help deal with those. Now oh, he's got a dragon there. Hmm. And he's got lava dragons over there. Okay. He's got a new unit, the Trail Runners. I haven't seen those before. I'm just going to send uh, three of the Phoenix Hawks 
uh, that way and three down here. Um, and that is it for my turn. Uh, I will see if I can do a little bit of damage to their the trolls and the dragon here. Slow them down a little bit. Um, okay. Let's see what they do. Ooh, oh, the lava dragons. That was unusual. Oh, he's got a lot of units. Come on. That was unusual for the lava dragons to take more damage than my harpies. That was very unusual. Might even be able to finish them off. Let's look what we're dealing with over here. Might get through the lava that's tricky. Oh. I'm gonna to have to protect those monks now because um they just took a lot of damage to those ogre hunters. bit of damage um, do I have level three Phoenix Hawks no it's just just level one what about my harpies no nope. hmm lot of damage there either okay well either way I need to take out these black dragons so even if I need to use three of my units against his one oh, that's what I'll have to do let's finish him off there uh, sometimes the harpies do pretty well against the black ice throwers they didn't do so well then I can only I can only try almost dead that's okay um Send these guys around to see if we can harass them a little bit. Now there is the shrine there. There's a few a few enemies scattered around the place. We found a magic sword, which is good. These guys, I guess, can just push forwards, hopefully to that town over there, and take that. Uh, try to take out the uh, the fire wizards here as well in the forest. Okay, so it'd be nice to finish them off. Uh, there we go, beautiful. And uh, do a little bit of damage to these guys because they're so hard to kill. No, it didn't do anything there. Um, and I do need to finish them off, otherwise they'll run away and uh, heal back up again. So let's do that and uh, see if we can deal with these ground troops. Let's heal them back up. If I get lucky, I can finish them off. Yes. And... Let's do it that way. Now I am in the rough terrain, 
So he shouldn't get his bonus when he attacks, uh, if he decides to attack, but he may go for the, uh, the legionaries up there. Looks like there's no one on that shrine, so that should be fairly easy to take. Let's see who else we've got. Um, just the flyers, and I will actually try to cast weakness here. Now, which works, so he may run away. Uh, we'll see what happens. So far, so good for this map. Hopefully it stays that way. Just taking out the harpies. Ooh. Does he have another army down to the south? He's got a lot of units here. Just Oh, these guys are nasty. Shadow Warriors. Looks like he's got more units. Does he have a... Oh, there's a couple of towns down here as well. Hmm, that could be tricky to get down to. These guys can just uh, step back. Heal up. Let's see what we've got here. Let's send them back to uh, heal up next turn. See if I can do a bit of damage to the uh, trolls. Finish them off there. Okay, let's recruit back up to 15. I can probably do that with the harpies uh, if I need to. Send the sandmen down. Let's see what else we're dealing with here. Now, he's got more cavalry. Um, we'll try to finish, oops, try to finish off the uh, ice throwers. And of course, take out his Uh, flyers. I can cast weakness here and do a double, a double hit on the bears and the fire barges. That actually worked really well. Ugh. Those lava dragons do so much damage. Whew. Um, now the bears are light cavalry, so they're more than a match for my light cavalry over here. I can oh, there's more. He's got like he's got a lot of light cavalry actually. So let's actually bring them up here and just cast eagle eye. Aha! A few more flyers we've spotted. He's got lots of units just dotted all around this map. So I know what to be careful of now. Send the flyers down to the south. He's got two of them. Hmm. Okay, so there is one town over there. I probably don't need to send too many troops across, but these these guys are kind of uh, committed now to going around this mountain. Trying to do a bit of damage here to the trail runners, finish them off. Okay, 
Okay, I need to see where his flyers are going to go. It's a bit silly just sending one of my flyers down because uh, that's not going to work. So we'll see if we can lure them up um, here and uh, then hopefully we can take them out. Otherwise, pressing forwards. Let's stay in the rough terrain for now. Um, that is it for my turn. A lot of damage there to the Rock Knights. Oh, he's attacking the Volunteers. One of the Flyers is going for the Phoenix Hawks. The Shadow Knights are nasty as well. The Shadow Warriors, I think they're called. Oh, he's got a lot of attacks with the Cavalry. I think we're just hanging in there. I didn't lose anyone. Luckily, almost lost these guys, though. Like Cavalry. Um, is there someone who can heal him up? Who's got some spells? Can heal him back up to 12, so he doesn't have to necessarily run away. Could do some damage. Hmm... These guys are nasty. Level 1. Still able to do a lot of damage. So they're quite hard to deal with. Surround this guy and ooh, not let him escape. Maybe able to finish uh, finish off these lava dragons. That would be good. Yes. Ooh. Okay. Hopefully we can force the surrender uh, sometime soon. Wow, five dead. That is nasty. We're coming up against some pretty tough opposition here. Okay, can't quite finish off these uh, Knights of Fire. We've also got the Ogre Knights making their way up, and they are uh, pretty tough as well. Whew. Okay, does he have any flyers here? He's got the uh, Earth Masters now. Okay. Hmm. Oh my god, the trial runners did eight wounds to Drago. Trying to finish them off. Finish off these bears if I can. Yes. Whew. Really need to heal up these these guys. These guys need to rest as well because they're broken. Okay, I've got some really injured troops here. I think Drago's dead next turn. 
Unless I can wound those guys enough so that they won't kill him. The bombardiers are getting away. I don't want them to get away. So we'll do that. These guys really need to heal up as well, actually. Um, I can send them somewhere where... Like over here to prevent these two from healing. It's probably a good idea. And maybe finish off the trail runners there. Okay. I'm worried about Drago. Very worried. These guys can recruit back up. Uh, there's not much I can do to save him though. It's one of my best heroes. She can't really do anything against... Did she do anything to this guy? She may be able to... Nope. It's a good try to uh, finish off those ogre hunters, but not quite good enough. Okay, so that's it. Now I do need to do something to save Drago. What can I do? Um, because, of the, because of zone of control, I don't think they can get through here. The mummies can reach. Um, I don't think he'll be able to get through there either. So it's really just the mummies. Let's try to cast a weakness here on the mummies. No, that didn't work. Well, let's hope he survives. Oh my god, what is that? Shaken up. Vega's broken. That was the Earth Master. Oh, he's still got a lot of units. That was the Earth Master spell. Drago's actually still alive. Surprisingly, I thought he was going to die. Oh. Um, so I can actually heal him back up, which is nice. Got some more dragons down there. Hmm. What can I do? His mummies are, are pretty tough here as well. Let's just... um. Do that and finish off the mummies there. Uh, these guys are going to get shot down by those. Uh, crossbowmen. Okay, finished off the Lava Warriors. Oh! Oh my god, I forgot about those guys underneath. I didn't even see them. Let's attack with the, uh, the level 2 Phoenix Hawks first. Ugh. The flyers are just pretty tough. Let's do that then. And, uh, wow, still did five damage. Those two did five damage to my Phoenix Hawks. Still got these skeleton archers. Uh, I can't really do much about them at the moment because uh, I'm running out of units over here. He's running away with his bears as well. So he'll probably heal them back up again. And uh, we're looking a little bit worse for wear up here as well. Let's um, actually take this town. That might encourage him to surrender a little bit quicker. 
Let's head on down, heal up where I can. Bears are, are pretty tough. Hmm, what am I going to do here? Now I don't see any flyers, so I might be safe to take them out with the uh, the Phoenix Hawks. These guys actually need to heal back up. Uh, so let's heal them back up, restore them back up to 15. These guys have ten, uh, five dead. Can we do anything against these bear riders? Not much is the, is the answer. Not much. Hmm. Let's see what we have here. Your troops find a magical crossbow. It's nice to have. Let's just defend that position there. Wait for the uh, sand men to get a little bit closer. Bring the harpies down to stop them from healing. Uh, who else do I have? These guys. Might get lucky with a... Hmm. Not, not that lucky. I've used up my spell as well, so this has been a pretty tough battle. It's been fairly even. Uh, let's see what they do. Okay, he's casting Whirlwind on the Harpies. He's still got the Black Ice Throwers there. Okay, could have gone worse. Definitely could have gone worse. Whew. So, can I please just finish these guys off? Come on. Oh. Well. That should do it. Oh, they've got some guys coming through the... Oh, this is not good. Oh, that was a lot of damage. Run away. Um, and get ready to defend against uh, these guys here. So it might be a good time to heal up. Okay, let's do it that way. Let's heal up my hawks as well. Keep them alive for as long as possible. There's the town down there, uh, which I'll have to check out if he doesn't surrender soon. Okay, what do we have to deal with over here? Is this? I think I'm getting this side under control. Let's just push down with the uh, all the sand men here. Quite know what to do with his shadow warriors at the moment. 
Um, actually, I can attack once, uh, then run away. Send my uh, Shadow Warriors to finish them off. There we go, that did work. Everyone else kind of needs to heal up. Wound them a little bit. You can sometimes do some good damage against those um, black ice throwers. So maybe I'll finish them off if I get lucky here. There we go. Uh, that did the job. These guys need to uh, let's heal them up as well. to defend here rather than attacking. Let's just hold a more of a defensive position. Heal him up there. Let's see who else we've got. These guys are far to the north, so I'll start bringing them down now to the south. Quick look at the map again. Okay, there's a couple of towns to the south. A town there and a town. Okay, so there's, there's still quite a few towns, but if I can Kill most of his troops. Hopefully, he'll surrender early. Um, okay, there's this town down there. Let's cause a bit of weakness here on the Yoga Knights, if I can. Okay, next turn. Ten turns left. Now, these are the knights I really need to worry about. Where'd they go? Oh, these ones here. The Shadow Knights, 36 melee attack, 27. Ah, uh, the regular cavalry. I'm very worried about these. They have a movement of five, so I'm gonna stay just out of reach if I can. That's finished them off. <sighs> Some more enemies have appeared. Let's heal these two back up. Uh, see if we can take out the uh, the lava dragons here. That's an equal attack. But if I attack with uh, multiple units, we can eventually take him out. The enemy offers to surrender, I'm definitely going to accept. Whew. That was a tough little uh, mission there. The Council of Five congratulates you on your victory over the Shadow Lord. They offer 300 gold to aid your cause. Now we don't have any new research available, but made a little bit of progress towards the Samurai. Uh, and the siege may take some time as well. But that gives us a little bit more money to purchase some more units. 262 gold now. Uh, so I'll have a think about that for the next battle. Um, that is it for now. We've got uh, two options. Ag uh, Agraxa Island and Isle of the Watchers. And then I think just one more and we're heading on to the Blood Earth Castle.